Hey folks, this is Brian London with Pinnacle Property Group, and it's time again for another walkthrough video. Uh, this is our Sailfish three bedroom, three bathroom. Now this is the 2200 square foot model with the third bath option, and also a 10 foot ceiling and planters across the back of the pool. So these are some of the details that I'm gonna be showing you through this walkthrough today. So we are just on the finishing touches of the punch out. So we will have appliances coming in um, and um, then basically caulking and paint and a couple of plumbing fixtures that are still left to be done. So the first thing that I wanna point out is we have here the 10 foot sliding glass door. And at the model, it has the slope ceiling that goes down just above where you would see this picture window up here. So you can see that we raised the ceiling height. We have the ceiling right here of 12 feet with a one foot tray and crown inside the tray. So this is a nice little feature and you can do this on our Marlin and up models. Um, another nice feature that this homeowner went with was the beautiful fantasy brown countertops. And then also we have a stainless steel farm sink undermounted underneath the granite. And then the homeowner will have a cooktop going here. They added the under cabinet lighting. And then we have a microwave combo going here. Um, and this will be cut out to the size for the microwave oven combo. Over here, we have a little bit different. You might've seen at the model, our wine bar. And what we have here instead are the floating shelves. So this is a nice little touch that the homeowner did. So let's check out the guest bedroom side of the home. All right, so to my left over here, we have our shaker cabinets with a beautiful quartz countertop and a nice bypass shower glass door. This is one of our new upgrade features that you can do with Pink Pinnacle. So pretty similar to what you would see as far as for a barn door. All right, over here, we have our rear bedroom that looks out into the pool area. A nice pantry closet. And then this is our third bath option, basically without changing the rear of the home. What we have over here is we have a bypass closet door. And then we have a single vanity with toilet and uh, the homeowner went with the uh, tub in here. So this is an ensuite bathroom and you can make this go either way for the second or third bedroom. All right, so we're gonna go out into the pool area. When we do these 10 foot do uh, doors, it does two things. One is we raise the ceiling height in the dining room area or the dinette. And then it also raises it in the lanai area. So what we have now is a 12 foot beam across the back. All right, so the pool cage height goes up, the soffit height goes up. And when you're building in the Northwest, and you're adding that third bathroom option. One of the things that we had to do to meet our clearance for the easement was that we had to build basically what this is a knee wall and we had to put the pool equipment on the rear of that. So I'll show you that back over here. So 
So we have the pool equipment going back over here. And then normally where you would have the pool equipment, you see the RO equipment. And let's go take a look at this. So over here we have all our RO equipment over here. A lot of people ask what that's gonna look like and here you go. And then we have our AC unit as far as over here. So we're gonna walk to the rear of the house where we have steps going down. And then what we have is for the fall protection of the back of the house, we have a planter that goes all the way across the back. So this will be painted and then inside the planter will be trees for the homeowner. So this will be a really nice setting as far as for the homeowner, for the dock, and for the back of the house. One more feature that I want to point out to you is we're going to take a look at the pool. This option for a pool is our 400 square foot free form pool. And what it is, is we're 32 feet in length. Okay. And then 16 feet wide from here to here with the sun shelf located over here. And the homeowner went with the powder coated handrail that you can use as far as stepping in and out of the pool. And if you're looking for a handrail, this is an option um, that you can add as far as if you're building with Pinnacle Building Solutions. Uh, another standard feature that you're gonna see out here too in our homes, in our Marlin and Up series, is that we have the hot and cold outdoor shower. Thank you for watching this walkthrough tour of a sailfish model, another home built by Pinnacle Building Solutions. If you are in the market and you are looking for an inventory home or you're looking for a lot, please check out our website at pinnaclepropertygrp.com. If you're looking to build and you are own a lot, please check out our website at pinnaclebuildingsolutions.com. Until next time, I'm Brian Ludden with Pinnacle Property Group.